First pitch, no surprise. A strike from Futrell. Just missing inside. Futrell can't believe it. One, two, hit out to left. Dunking, fair ball. And it hit the net over there. Miller trots into second. Mestis is over to third. A little bit of a flare double there. Bounced over to third. Diaz going to look going to the long way over to first, over to Holcomb to make the play for the first out. A productive first out for Temis Ferry and the Bulldogs. Change up, shot out to right center. Austin makes the play. Let's see what Futrell goes with here. Fastball, bounced over to Davis. He will make the play to end the inning, but not before the Bulldogs strike first in the top of the first in the bottom of the ninth. It's Bolger, bangs one up the middle. Gapper could tie the game. Fastball misses low. First walk issued by O'Brien. Big pitch in the first. Called strike three. Painted fastball, glove side from O'Brien at 94. The talent level that Tim Corbin's brought to this program. Laniv lines one to right center, it's down. laniv has got some speed. He's gonna trot into second, a leadoff double. Spencer Jones, 25th pick to the Yankees, 470 feet. We are talking about it yesterday in spring training. He'll be in the show at some point. Hopefully later this year. Gonna be a tough play out to right field. It's gonna drop. Laniv's gonna go to third. Diaz hustling into second. 3-2. Upstairs, ball four. Have some better success. 3-1. Upstairs, ball four. A bases loaded walk. Back-to-back -back walks issued by O'Brien. Nowhere to put Bolger yet again. 3-2. Smashed. Left center, this is down. Up against the wall, one run will score. Here comes Holcomb. They're gonna hold Vastine at third. The play at second, not in time. Bolger just got in there safely and he's grabbing his left hamstring. So he delivers. Doors have their first lead of the day, but boy, you do not wanna see that. If anything, he's gonna come out of the game. Just for his uh, career and his senior year, you, you hope it's it's not, not too bad. Austin. Out to right. Should score another run, and Hewitt's going to tag behind. Throw to third is off the mark. So both runners tag up. Vastine scores. It's four to one doors. Over to second. Bobbled, and the play has to be made at first. Hewitt, of course, has great wheels coming down the line. That was watching him, Andrew. You got a great secondary. You know, are you in control of your mind? Are you in control of your body? Up the middle, Miller fires to first off the mark. Bit of a risky throw there. Espinal had it beat by a mile. Not holding on to Espinal, he can get a big jump. Davis bangs one to left field. It's a fair ball. Espinal, of course, running on the pitch and nobody was holding him on. He's gonna get the wave. Throw from Miller, there is no throw. Two out, RBI double. Davis delivers again for the doors, six to one here. It's a six spot and potentially counting in this second inning. Yeah, he's able to get that pitch elevated. Nice piece of hitting right there, but. But he's able to score because nobody's holding him on there. Leneve shoots one out to left. Temis Ferry shielding the sun, sees it at the last moment to make the play. I, I want to talk more about that and a wicked mustache. That's very true. I mean, that's <laughs> solid. Gets by Ratfield. Ratfield's done a nice job behind the plate today, but couldn't stop that one. Just missed low. That was a 12-6 bender there. Shot, past Mestis. Gets into right field. Espinal is gonna come in to score, and the throw was cut off. A little surprised by that. Miller cuts it off. Might have had a chance there. Davis at third, would have been close. But nonetheless, Leniv delivers again under the glove of Mestis. It's seven to one. Leniv does not go. Diaz chops one. Gonna be a tough play. Play is made, barely. 
Nice job by the third baseman and Hankins to fire across the diamond. Better yesterday. Feld was great and Hofberg was excellent as Vastein yanks one down the right field line. Vastein can run. It's at least a double. Gets into the corner. He's content with a one out double. Austin to center. Pretty deep. But caught in front of the warning track out there in center field. Temis Vary shoots one to right. This is pretty deep. It is up against the wall. So Notre Dame beats Harvard Westlake there. Temis Vary with a double to lead off the top of the sixth. So excited for that young man. Swing and a miss. Back to back punch outs for Leboki. Third base coach and recruiting coordinator. We previously had you know, David Macias. You could look into guys in the portal and guys that can help you. I think really checked a lot of those boxes. Taylor made 6 4 3. Nice job by Miller coming out of the pen. <laughs> February 25th. And such a blessing to have such a nice day out here on a, on a Sunday. Good crowd. Nice smack in the left field. Yeah, that's by a Knowles. pinch hitter there. That's Peyton Knowles. Preferred walk ons, right? He walked onto the team last year for him. Their best statistical returner, and he dunks one into right field. That's his first hit of the series. And what we know about Mark Maktoff teams, they don't quit, they don't go away. 3 2. Smashed, 3 4 hole. It's a base hit for Eisenstadt, his second knock of the day. The bases are now full of Bulldogs. Nobody out here in the top of the seventh. So another pinch hitter coming to the plate. This is Tyler Griggs. Saw him in the nine hole yesterday. First pitch swinging. Hewitt shielding the sun. Should be deep enough to score a run. Hewitt's throw goes to third. So Hewitt concedes the run there. It's seven to two. Smashes another one off the glove of Vastine who leaped up to try to make the play. Stamu had to wait to see if Vastein was going to catch it. So he advances 90 feet, station to station. We definitely have here in a tough spot. Bounced up the middle, Vastein flips to Davis. It gets by Davis. So a run is going to score here. It's seven to three. Donovan Ratfield, who's got four hits on the series. Chopped, Diaz. Diaz off the glove. No throw. Oh boy, unraveling here a little bit in this top of the seventh inning. Just spins, but doesn't really break. Banged off the glove of Holcomb. Defensive blunders galore here in the top of the seventh for the Commodores. And listen, I know that thing was hit hard, but I think Holcomb's gonna tell you he's gotta have that. 2-0 here against Hamburg. Could see some action. Dangerous pitch. 2 all swinging right center. This is into the gap, and it's gone! Hamburg Grand Slam! Are you kidding me? That ball just kept on going. I thought it was gonna short hop the wall. It just cleared it. It's a Grand Slam, just the second hit of Hamburg's Gonzaga career. It's a big smash. Yeah, had the 2-0 count. Was sitting on the fastball and he got it. I mean, that's a fastball right down the gut. Nice looking swing, good backspin. Right out to right center and man, this game has just turned on its head quickly. Did it yesterday, looks like a nice Lemieux. charge into left field. Out to left, off the monster. How about another double for Troy Leneve? Now you got to answer, right? That's a big start here to this bottom of the seventh. See if the makeup of this team, if they can continue to, to come back. Austin Fort bounces one to first. Three, six, one, double play. What a turn by the Zags infield. Calvin Hewitt waits on deck. Goes to the fastball, got him looking. Sotelo fired up, coming off the bump. He gets out of the jam. 3-2. Called strike three. Big pitch for Miller Green. He's pumped up. Nice job by the freshman out of the pen. Espinal to left. Way back there, off the monster. He's got to be careful here, but it popped out of the glove of Temisvery. 
Espinal was thinking two all the way. It's a lead off double here to start the bottom of the ninth. RBI double today. First pitch swinging, 5-6 hole base hit. Espinal station to station, cannot get thrown out on the base pass here. All of a sudden, here we go again, tying run at first, the winning run coming to the plate. Laniv bounces one, could be a 4-6-3, he runs well though, and there's gonna be no throw to first. So the doors are within one here. One, two. Popped up. Shallow center gonna be a tough play, but the play is gonna be made. Great play by the second baseman and Hankins for the second out. Lined base hit, 5-6 hole. How about Humphrey? Pinch run ran yesterday, scored the winning run. Jonathan Vastine, who's one for two today. Slider called, strike three. Nathan Huber rings up Jonathan Vastine to end the game, and Sotelo shuts the door on the doors. A 9-8 series finale, a thriller here in Nashville. Eight runs in the top of the seventh. Jordan Hamburg's Grand Slam, the difference.